Hey everyone, welcome to this month's episode of Ian's RV Talk. Today, I wanna to talk about understanding solar basics. Now, when I initially set out to create this video, I had this big grand idea of having all these animations, breaking it down in its simplest form. And as I've come to find out, Keystone actually has already done exactly that. And honestly, it's a great video. John Brock, one of the lead engineers, I met him a few times, wonderful guy, super smart. Uh, we'll walk you through the entire thing. I did put that video in the description, put the link in there so you can watch it in its entirety. I do recommend it, it's a great video. And I will be referring to that a little bit uh, in this video. So here is solar in its simplest form. I like to use what they call the gas tank analogy. If your RV battery is like the gas tank in your car, then your solar panels are like the gas pump. The bigger your RV battery is, the more energy it can hold. Just like the bigger your gas tank in the car is, the more gas it can hold. The more panels you have, the faster you can put energy, the more efficiently you can put energy into that battery. Just like the fuel pump, the bigger the pump, the faster it's gonna pump gas into your car. Now, it has to be a balance when we talk about solar. You need enough energy, so you need a big enough battery, preferably lithium, to run everything in the RV you want to run. The more you use, the faster it's going to deplete. So you have your solar panels to try to fill that back up. So a lot of people are under the misconception that the bigger solar panels you have, the more you can run, and that's simply not true. The bigger solar panels, the more wattage you have, will simply allow you to recharge the batteries more efficiently. So yes, it is a piece in the overall system as if you're going to be using a lot of energy out of your large batteries, well, you're gonna to wanna to be able to refill that so you will need big enough panels. And that's really all there is to it, folks. At its core level, at the most, as simple as I can get it, that is understanding solar basics. Uh, again, John Brock did a great video with Keystone. I, that is in the description. If you wanna watch that video, I do recommend it. Also, if you wanna see more Ian's RV talk, you're looking for great how-to troubleshooting information, make sure you subscribe. Till next time, we'll see you.